Hey everybody in Facebook land, Rania Phillips here. Hope everybody's having a good day. Come to you fresh faced with no makeup right after yoga. Sitting on my street, which is near Wrigley Field in Chicago. The Cubs just won. Boop, boop. So we are a buzz with people walking back from the game and tons and tons of traffic. But I just love the street. Look at I'm sitting in front of an awesome store. Look at this. It's Candyality. I love this place. It's all candy. It's so cool. It's like totally retro. We took some of our engagement pictures here. So I hope everybody's having a good day. I just wanted to pop on and tell you, you know what, I'm so grateful for everything in my life. I hope you are too. And um, there's been a theme in my team lately about people finding their gift. So we have a bunch of Cubs people walking by. They're going to think I'm nuts talking to myself. Um, but yeah, so I did a video before about me leaving nursing career and going into something I have passion about. So a lot of people have said, look what you did when you were a child. What did you love to do when you were a kid? Believe it or not, I loved to do um, commercials. I'd go into my bathroom with the uh, old fashioned tape recorder, you know, the ones that you press, the real big ones. And I would film commercials because the acoustics were good, right? And I don't know if you guys remember, I'm probably aging myself, but do you remember that shampoo call? called G your hair smells terrific oh my god do you guys remember there was an actual shampoo called G your hair smells terrific total cheesy 70s shampoo and I used to do that commercial I also used to sing so I was a little performer so no wonder at part of what I do for work which is not really work it's it's more like my lifestyle is be on live video I love it I'm a little performer I guess I don't know I wish I could I had an amazing voice I have an okay voice but you know I was in musicals and in, in um, high school a lot of plays always in choir love that stuff so just because you're good at something just because you went to college for something it doesn't mean that's what you're stuck doing for the rest of your life you know I mean I was good at nursing I was good at case management I was very interested I still am I love learning about nursing and the human body I like learning about it more than doing it. So I'm still making a difference in the world. Look at this cute street. I just love our street. Still making a difference in the world and helping women find their confidence and then just, just building people's confidence and watching them soar and find their dreams is, is absolutely amazing. You know, women sometimes they feel very confined and shut in, especially after having little babies at home. And when you just give them a little push, show them that they can be confident and go out in the world and do whatever they do, whatever they want to do. It just, it just brings so much joy and fills my cup to watch everybody soar. And I, I, it's just, it's a miracle. I love it. I, I, I know more women need to discover how to find this in themselves, how to find what lights up their soul. Um, I'm not saying something superficial like makeup and skincare lights up your soul, but it's our culture. Hi everybody, all my favorite ladies are jumping on. Hi Auntie Ag, oh my goodness, yay! So I just wanted to say I'm grateful. There's so much in life to aspire to, live to, find your confidence and chase your dreams. Don't be stuck in a job that because you went to school for it, that you should be there. Living in a cubicle and fighting traffic, that was like hell on earth. Although I miss all my friends. I did have a, as miserable as being in a little cubicle all day was, the people around me made it happen. You guys all know who you are. But um, I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Cubs win. It's a beautiful day in Chicago. Can't wait for super warm weather to come. And that's all I wanted to say. So spread joy, everyone. Take care. Bye.